Hi everyone, it's Andrea and I'm going to do a flip through the new Jade Summer book which is, as you can see, Kawaii Horror. This one's literally only just been released. Hopefully I'll get this up within the, a day or two of it actually being released or filmed. I'm filming from a new location. This is now in my covering space, a spare bedroom. So this is the first time I'm filming here so bear with me if it's a bit wobbly because I've got it on a tray on the bed and I'm sitting to one side of it because that's just the easiest way for me to do it. I can still see what I'm doing. So here we go, Koi Horror by Jade Summer. So here's the front and the back, hard to see. I may have to change the camera angle slightly. It's not as angled as I normally would like it. So let's just have a quick, let's see what it looks like inside. So. Now I've had a quick look at this book and I do like it. Actually it's not too bad, just use my hand. I'll just zoom in just a little bit. I probably have to change it slightly for when I'm filming colouring charts so that's why I'm doing this first so this is the first one the cover picture and the next one so these are really sweet I like this I like this book when I saw it I thought yeah I've definitely got to have this one so that's yeah you can see it I'm just checking so and here's the next. So like I said, this is the first time I've filmed in this location. I think this book is absolutely brilliant. I'm, I'm really going to enjoy colouring in this one, I think, because I like... I've got Kawaii Fantasy, and I've got Kawaii Girls as a line art, but I've got Kawaii Fantasy um, Grayscale. And I just, I just love it. I think they're brilliant. I mean, I, I didn't want to wait for this to come out in grayscale, which I'm sure they will at some point, but it might be a year or so before it comes out. So if um, you're watching this video and it, you can't see the pictures and you want me to refilm it, let me know and I will do. Um, like I said, this is the first time doing it on this uh, setup. So it's going to take me a while to get it 100% right. I must admit, I do like a lot of the Jade Summer books and I've got about 45 of them now. And there is still some I want, some I haven't got. Look at that one. That one's good. Nice one. <laughs> Their arms around the skeleton. I do like this book. Very, very much looking forward to colouring in this one. I'm not going to lie. Uh, every time I move a page, I'm pulling the book slightly back. That's quite a good one. There's not so much in there. You can see that she's scared and she's crying. But there's not a huge amount of detail. There's a chain behind her. Um, but I like that one. And this one with the puppets, doll puppets. <laughs> She's been chased by a couple of ghosts. And that's quite good on holding the skull. I like that one. Little devil girl there. are absolutely fantastic. I think the Jade Summer books get better and better. You know, sometimes I see them and I think, oh, I don't know if I want that one. I might wait and watch a flip through and then if I like the pictures, uh, I'll get it. But this one, as soon as I saw the cover, I knew I'd be ordering it. There you go. And back to the beginning. So that's, that's all the pictures and as usual, you get two copies of each one, which is pretty cool because you could do one in pencils and one in markers or um, you could save one for another time. For instance, I'll be saving some of the some of them for Jennifer to do, especially some of the easier books. 
uh, she can do them then when she's a bit older. So I hope you've enjoyed this flip through of Jade Summer Kawaii Horror. If the angle's not quite right, please let me know and I will adjust it in the next one. I'm probably going to keep playing around with it. Um, but I'll, uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.